Now at 5.30 and more on Charlie Sheen's HIV announcement earlier today. The actor announcing publicly this morning that he is HIV positive. CBS 4's Elliot Rodriguez is in the control room now with reaction. Elliot? Well, Rick and Rudabay, between his prominent films and television roles and his very public meltdowns, Charlie Sheen is one of Hollywood's most recognizable faces. I'm here to, to admit that I am, in fact, uh, HIV positive. Sheen ended days of rumors telling NBC's Matt Lauer he is HIV positive. He was diagnosed four years ago. Have you had unprotected sex on any occasion since your diagnosis? Yes, but, but the two people that, that, that I did that with um, were under the care of my doctor and, and they were completely warned ahead of time. Sheen putting a face to a disease that affects thousands, 50,000 new cases a year. In South Florida, the number of cases jumped 23% in 2015. Activists hope his announcement brings compassion to those living with HIV. The reaction should be the same as with any other condition. What can I do for you? Are you okay? Maria Mejia has been living with HIV for 27 years. She's an outspoken activist. The shame and the stigma associated with the disease perpetrates more cases she says all these things that that we read about no matter how thick skin you have as an activist or as a person living with HIV they hurt I've told enough he has a history of substance to, uh, abuse and bad behavior including highly publicized liaisons with prostitutes he's been married three times and has five children individuals who are optimally treated who have undetectable viral loads who responsibly use protection have an incredibly low, it's incredibly rare to transmit the virus. While there are incredible advances in medicine suppressing the disease, it's still contractable. Activists like Maria promote education and safe sex. Well, Sheen says he's been blackmailed and has had to pay to date more than $1 million to keep his condition a secret. In the control room, Elliot Rodriguez, CBS 4 News. Elliot, thank you.